Do I have to file ISF for fashion chokers necklaces? Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're going to discuss whether you need to file an importer security filing ISF, for fashion chokers and necklaces. So, let's dive right in. The importer security filing, also known as ISF, is a requirement by U.S. Customs and Border Protection CBP, for all containers arriving in the United States by sea. It is designed to enhance the security of the supply chain and ensure the safety of the U.S. borders. Now, when it comes to fashion chokers and necklaces, the first thing you need to determine is whether you are the importer or not. If you are the importer of record, then yes, you are responsible for filing an ISF. If you're not the importer, but rather a carrier or a freight forwarder, then it is usually the responsibility of the importer to file the ISF. The ISF consists of specific information about the cargo, the shipper, and the consignee, among other details. It needs to be filed at least 24 hours before the cargo is loaded onto a vessel bound for the United States. Failing to comply with the ISF requirements can result in penalties, delays, and even the potential seizure of the cargo. Therefore, it is crucial to ensure that you file the ISF accurately and on time. When it comes to fashion chokers and necklaces, it's important to remember that customs regulations can be complex and may vary depending on the materials and value of the items. It is advisable to work with a licensed customs broker who can guide you through the process and help you navigate any potential challenges. Additionally, if you're importing fashion chokers and necklaces in commercial quantities, you may also need to consider obtaining a customs bond. A customs bond acts as a financial guarantee to ensure that you will comply with all customs regulations and pay any applicable duties and fees. Customs bonds are required for various reasons, such as when you're importing goods that are subject to high duties or if you're using a customs broker to clear your shipments. They provide security to the government that the proper duty, taxes, and fees will be paid, and that the goods will be properly reported. Lastly, it's important to note that customs regulations and requirements can change over time. Staying informed and up-to-date with the latest developments is crucial for a smooth import process. That's all for today's video. We hope this information has been helpful in understanding whether you need to file an ISF for fashion chokers and necklaces. Remember, it's always best to consult with a customs broker to ensure compliance and avoid any complications. Thank you for watching, and we invite you to tune in to our upcoming videos, where we'll be covering more topics related to customs brokerage, customs bonds, and international trade. Disclaimer note below, see you next time.